be totally honest with y'all, man. It's only easy if you running with people that know what they doing. Cause I done ran it. Hello everybody, my name is Snake. DST. And today I have another build video for you. But today's build video is a PvE oriented revival build. That's what the title says. So let's look into it. Here's what I'm working with. As you can see, there's it is not meant for attack. It's not meant for killing things. No 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 no. It's meant for reviving people. We got four piece reclaimer because of the ninja bite. We got two piece tack, which means it three piece tack. So let's let's just let's just overview what the ninja bike does. Basically, slots in any equipped gear set item to fill a requirement towards unlocking gear set bonus. Can unlock bonuses from multiple sets simultaneously. Obviously not classified. My ninja bike has got electronic mods on, support station healing speed on. And uh yeah, that's 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 what it does. It has health on it. I wish it would have skill power, but I needed to roll it over to skill power. So, you know, health isn't too bad at all, always. Burn resistance. And then Reclaimer. Now, let's just review what Reclaimer does. So the two-piece, support station range. The three-piece, the duration. The four-piece of Reclaimer is support station gains. The benefit of all of the support stations at the same time. And on this one, we have two electronic pieces. One with health, one with skill power. Um... The skill haste I can probably add on to that to make it go faster, or uh, do I have another one? More health, skill haste, but right now I'm just running whatever I got to get that electronic up there pretty far. Then my mask, which is Tactician's Authority, tech build, is skill power and electronics, obviously. with uh, this, if was, Let's look at what the uh, Tactician does. Two piece gives you skill haste for plus fifteen percent, and the three piece gives you ten percent more skill power. So that's why I have so much skill power. And then this one just has electronics and skill power on it. Uh, I don't think I can make that go any higher. Doesn't look like it. And then the knee pads, it's skill power rolled, good armor, fifteen thirty two skill power plus the uh, uh, electronics mod, which is skill power, and the performance mod is four point fifty percent. Uh, support station healing speed. That's not the max, by the way. I think the max is 5%, and I only have one of those, unfortunately. So I was kind of unlucky with that, but it's whatever. And then obviously the Reclaimer Holster, 1,000 armor. Skill Haste rolled onto it, but plus 7%. There's my stats on there. And then you got uh, the support station healing speed by 5%, yeah. So, and you get that. Reclaimer Gloves, we got 1261. I probably should have... um. I mean, the, they were already pre-rolled like this, so I just used it because if I want to use my assault rifle, my assault rifle can do some type of damage. But obviously, yeah, I probably want more skill power or skill haste on this on the gloves as well, uh, followed by whatever damage and crit, whatever you have. But it has good armor and it has 1261 electronics, so it's not too bad. It's not gonna kill me, you know. And then over to the weapons. I mean, you guys really need to see the weapons too much because I can't even unlock most of them. But I got my lightweight. Has this responsive on it. MP5. It's got deadly. Got my pistol here with uh, nothing on it because <laughs> it's just a pistol. But uh, yeah. So then let's go over to the abilities. So I rock defibrillator, or you can rock you can rock any of these really. But I call it the revival build because I want to keep my friends up alive and moving. So I use defib for that matter. You guys can see the stats down there of what it does or how much it does for base in total and then obviously you i, I run the uh whatever it doesn't matter which support station you run because i'm running reclaimer so running one of these you run all of them but i run this one just because i don't i don't know i just picked it there's all the base stats for it from base to total obviously revival link recovery link my towns are as follows triage so if you will run through i'll get all my steals back uh cool down by 15 percent per person I mean, I can run other things on here. I can probably run Battle Buddy. That might be a good idea. Um, I also run Critical Save for, you know, popping med kits. Combat Medic, as we all know and love, and Strike Back. So if I ever get low on health, I get my skills back a little bit faster. Um, there's many things you can do here. You can probably run, um, you know, 
you, you could probably, uh, I mean, I, I would really think that, um, that the, nothing really here, maybe this, I don't know, but probably battle buddy, maybe if I want to get rid of triage and put for battle buddy, so if I do this, people who get revived get that 30% bite for 10 seconds for both players, reduces income damage, so that might be a better thing than triage, but you guys can pick between which one you really want. Um, and, uh, yeah, that's, that's really about it. I mean, there's not much to show. I'm gonna go over here and override it, save it. There's not much really to show, like, uh, when it comes to, you know, shooting and showing you guys what it really does. Uh, cause it's not meant for PvP. It's really meant for PvE. I mean, you could probably use it during a PvP fight encounter. But I haven't tested that out yet because I just really want to. I just have been focusing so much on PVE. Uh, 1.7 just dropped, so you know, trying to keep uh, try to keep your friends alive in those critical outbreak missions is very critical. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. I will see you guys in the next one. Also, guys, before I forget, I forgot to go over um the the stats of my of my stuff so here's my stats for this build i'm really sorry i forgot to just go over it but yeah you guys go you guys can see what this uh, build does and go down to pass all the zeros we got the damage elites ead Threat, skill power, skill has 20.2%. Yeah, I can see all that right there. Anyway, there's that. I apologize. Yeah.